Okay, you have a tetrapeptide given to you over here. Yeah, this is an integer question. Uh, this tetrapeptide is made up of these four different uh, amino acids that are given to us over here. The conditions are that alanine must be at the terminal COH. You are asked to figure out how many combinations could you have of these four. If the other condition being that at the other end, the NH2 group is attached to a chiral carbon. Okay, these are your two conditions. So let me write them down. But before that, do I need the structures of all of these four? Not entirely. Yeah, I can do away with that idea. How is that? Let's use these two conditions and see if we can eliminate stuff and uh, still arrive at the answer. So the first condition is that alanine, ALA, is always going to be at the terminal COOH. Okay. And uh, the other end is always going to have a chiral center. Now, this gives me two fixed positions. Yeah, ALA is always going to be at the COOH end and Glycine, GLY cannot be at the chiral center because it's not optically active. Yeah, with me there, these two conditions help us solve this. So this is the whole compound, the whole tetrapeptide that you see over here. Okay, uh, you see on one end, one end I put a C star, which is the chiral center. Other end, I fix that this is alanine. Yeah, so this is why the conditions one and two are written over here and over here. Okay, so let's move that up and uh, let's let's actually form these combinations now. Okay, I fix alanine. Remember, at one end, and the other end is not glycine. So that gives me these four options and your answer is four. Simple permutation and combination from there. Well, you don't have to use any permutation, combination Fam formula. You just you can just uh, figure it out by this, right? Uh, very cool question. Use some basic ideas. It is a bit time consuming. Yeah. But if you are smart about it, you will definitely get this correct as we just saw. So your answer is four. For more videos and live lectures on the JEE, click on the subscribe button now.